As cases continue to increase, Indiana officials are preparing to ramp up testing in the state with the help of a new partnership. Thousands of Hoosiers will now have access to tests free of charge. Demetrius Sanders joins us now with who is eligible and what this means for the state. Demetrius. Mike, Indiana officials say their goal is to test every symptomatic Hoosier in the state. And over the course of the next month, testing could increase by nearly double. As of Tuesday, around 87,000 Hoosiers have been tested for COVID-19. We're still ahead of several of our, of our neighbors in the Midwest area, and I think that we're just going to continue to expand. Soon, Indiana will increase testing across the state. With the help of a partnership with the Indiana State Department of Health and the company OptumServe, 20 testing sites will be launched next week and an additional 30 by mid-May. OptumServe will collect the swab specimens and manage the testing and reporting of data. Once all sites are open, officials expect as many as 6,600 Hoosiers can be tested per day and 100,000 are expected to be tested within the first month. This is in addition to testing already being performed by the state. Testing is for any symptomatic Hoosier as well as close contacts of positive cases or residents of congregate living settings. The test will be free of charge and those tested will receive their results in 48 hours on average. And Weaver says a lot of hard work went into Tuesday's announcement. I've been um, really impressed with what we've kind of figured out how to do here. And, and like I said, I think we're just going to increase more and more, especially with this new partnership with Optum. Now, registration for testing will open 48 hours before sites do. The tool to register is expected to launch soon. And Indiana National Guard armories in both Terre Haute and Vincennes have been chosen among the first 20 sites to open next week. Mike.